Well, how did things change at the BSA factory from year to year? I'm going to take a look at this barrel. This is the head that came off the bike. Now, I'll try to give you a video shot of that. And what you want to look at and take note of is the sides. The matching of the cylinder head to the barrel. And you can see there, no overlapping uh, edge or anything like that. It's quite well matched. And that's the matching head to the 69 barrel. Now, I'm going to put the camera down for a second and you're going to put the other cylinder head on. So maybe I'll shut it off. The folded head that I was going to build up and, and put on the bike. But if you look at the outer edge there, you can see that there's quite a large lip around this side of the uh, cylinder head. This side is well matched to the side of the, the bore. doesn't look like it's undercutting at all, but quite well matched there. But the hemisphere on this side is obviously lipped over. So there's a, a good place for air to be forced along that lip outside of the uh, head gasket for sure would cause a head gasket uh, blow quite easily. I'm going to um, mark that with a marker. I'll show you that. Okay. I'm going to take our marker and try to draw along the edge. I'm not sure I'll be able to videotape this, but draw along the edge with the marker so that we're marking where that is interfering. And you could use a bigger marker, but uh, that will be taken to the machine shop and then the uh, machine to match the barrel, but not before the show, so we're putting on the old head. We'll rebuild that one.